name's Harold Edom. My face you will not recognize. But I bet you've seen a lot of my work. You for me. For 20 years, I've been a Hollywood stuntman. Oh, Hal said, I'm not going to put my life behind a 700. He was the first human to test the airbag. You know, when nobody knew anything about the airbag, and there's Hal. When I first started to go out to pitch Hal, it was not an easy task. because I broke my back for the second time. Cat out of the bag. Hi there, David. How are you? Nice of you to drop in. Thank you very much. On the other hand, I think Bert wanted to be Hal Needham, but knew... I think it was probably 70, 80 feet across to the barn. Even though he was banged up pretty good, he got out of the car and continued to play the part. And it's sideways, spin it completely around 360 degrees, do all those things with it, and know exactly where that car is at. Why do you drive like that, Hal? Why do I drive like that? Well, there's a couple reasons. Number one's money, and the second one is uh, we're making a movie. Fast cars, that was dangerous stuff. I did a thing where... I'm, I'm in an airplane, the guy's riding along on horseback, and I dive out of the airplane or jump out the airplane and knock him off the horse, called a bulldog. They paid me a lot of money. People said I couldn't do it because I was too small. Hal said to me, I'm getting too old to bury my head in the dirt anymore. Hal Needham had made a living, you know, sort of falling on his head for 20 or 30 years. The wide shots were stunt people. 